new case for a normal distribution of 100 items q1 is 73 and standard deviation is 15 find out number one median and number two limits for central 50 percent of the item limits for central 50 percent of the items that means we require to find out interquartile range q3 minus q1 and for that purpose we require to find out q3 now on the basis of the previous sums we know that quartile deviation equals to two thirds standard deviation approximately that means q3 minus q1 by 2 equals to 2 by 3 into 15 that means q3 minus q1 equal divided by 2 equals to 10 that means q3 minus q1 equals to 20 now we know that q1 is 73 that means q3 minus 73 equals to 20 that means q3 equals to 20 plus 73 or q3 equals to 93 Now what? We require to find the first answer median or Q2, second quartile. We know another property of normal distribution. The quartiles are equidistant. That means Q2 minus Q1 equals to Q3 minus Q2. Quartiles are equidistant. That means the difference between second quartile and first quartile is exactly equal to the difference between third quartile and second quartile. Now we have Q173 and Q393. Just simplify. Q2 plus Q2 equals to 93 plus 73. That means 2Q2 equals to 166. That means Q2 equals to 83. And Q2 is nothing but our median. Is 83. This is our first answer. Median for this case is 83. Limits for Central 50% of the items or of the values. Lower limit is Q1 that is given to be 73 and upper limit is Q3 or the highest quartile that we found 93. And the range of this 50% or central 50% of the items which we know is inter quartile range popularly known as IQR and what is IQR? the difference between the highest quartile and the lowest quartile or Q3 minus Q1 that means 93 minus 73 that is 20. So IQR or the limits or rather range of central 50% of the items or central 50% of the data values is IQR that is 20. We had already found it here. 